Good evening. Doing another mystery opening. It's not a box this time. Uh, in recognition of the Disney Plus week anniversary, I've got a mystery bundle from my local comic book shop, or LCS as the cool kids say. Uh, this theme, if you can see there, Star Wars. Ten comic books, five dollars, sealed with thin metal and a piece of plastic tape. So let's see what we've got. I've got my kids' safety scissors. Get my stitches out this week, so maybe the uh, PTSD will wear off and I can use a big boy cutter again sometime soon. So, that little cool comic book shop. Dork's Den, again, temp comic books, $5. This week's theme, in honor of the week anniversary for Disney+, Plus and everyone's love of The Mandalorian, was the Star Wars themed mystery bag. So let's see what we got here. Everyone's favorite, Chewbacca. Chewbacca number one. Everyone loves Chewy. Ooh, this one's thick. Guys, you know I like them thick. What do we got here? Heft. This one has some heft to it. Tag and bank. All right. Star Wars Legends, tag and bank. We are here. Uh, must be a modern. Let's see if we've got a date on this thing. Probably, but I'm not smart enough to figure it out. Looks fairly modern, but doesn't look like one I would like. To be honest with you, I'm not the hugest Star Wars fan. I like the movies. I listen to some of the stuff uh, about it on podcasts, but I'm not a diehard guy. Ooh. A little R2-D2 on that one. A little Luke Skywalker. What do we got? Star Wars 8. Pretty nifty. Um, I have started watching The Mandalorian. My wife is out on it, so it's not a couple's show for us anymore. Uh, really, for me, it's production value. I'm not in love with it the way everyone else is. But there's enough for me. Ooh, Poe. You know, if you like the current movies, maybe you like you some Poe. You know, those mouthy fly boys, they just want to win everything. Number 31. All right. Just cruising right along. Ooh, got some glare. Back it. Oh. Also, from the current movies, Beckett number one. Maybe that's a good one. Who knows? I don't know like any values of these off the top of my head. If any of you guys see any that are noteworthy, you should definitely throw it in the comments and let me know. Ooh. Everyone's favorite, Lando Calrissian. Number four, double or nothing. All right. It's got some Darth Vader going on there, but it's Dr. Afra, number 12. All right. I guess I bet anything with Darth on the cover has probably got a little extra half to it. Kind of like the Joker and other notable figures. Like if they're on the cover, it's just that much better for the book. Ooh, Solo. This must be this, those characters from the movie. Better than people thought. It's actually a good one. My kids like it. I think because there's a lot of Chewbacca in it. Uh, but that one wasn't bad. 
All right. All right, down to the final two. Ooh, I like a special. I've noticed that some of these definitely have the actors from the movie, so we've got Age of the Republic special. We've got, the, is it the first appearance of the purple lightsaber? Specially made for Samuel L. Jackson, so he could see himself in the battle scenes. Lore to come after the actor special request. All right, the final one. Let's see. Drum roll, please. I think that was anticlimactic. Cannon the Padawan, number four. So we had ten comics, ten up, ten down, and uh, it was a pretty good little Star Wars set. You know, I like a good theme. Themes are important, and uh, in honor of Disney Plus and uh, Mandalorian. I think it was a good way to go with the Star Wars one. Again, if you have any interest in any of the comic books you've seen in my videos, just message me and uh, we can definitely work something out. All right, until next time.